Psychologists call the paradox mindset the ability to hold together seemingly conflicting ideas in one's mind. Some say it's the secret to Einstein's success. Well, how do those of us who may not be Einstein still cultivate this paradox mindset? One way we can do so is by reflecting on well-known paradoxes from the history of philosophy. The Buddhist tradition uses all kinds of paradoxes to help students achieve enlightenment. The most famous one being the Zen paradox, what is the sound of one hand clapping? Another is when all beings have been liberated, no beings have been liberated. Because once you're liberated, you're no longer a being. In fact, you never were from a Buddhist perspective, in a true sense. There are also a lot of paradoxes used by European philosophers going back to ancient Greece. One of the more recent ones is Jacques Derrida's notion that hospitality is a paradox. 